Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh and welcome to another Mal Chemistry video. In this video, we will be unboxing the oxygen set. First experiment we're going to be performing is called the blue bottle. Um, but before we start this experiment, I'm going to give a special shout out to my cousin, Vasilis. Um, he's been supporting us and yeah, thank you very much. So now let's start. We're gonna first have to prepare some hot water in advance, so I will go do that right now. Now that the hot water is boiling, we're gonna take some stuff from the starter kit. So first, we're gonna take the funnel and the glass flask, safety glasses, the plastic tray, and a rubber stopper. From the set, from the set, we'll take a double-ended measuring spoon, some gloves, pin opener, some calcium hydroxide, lactose, and lastly, some methylene. Okay, now let's start. I will start off by putting on my gloves. Okay, so first, I will fill the flask approximately a quarter full of warm water. Let's go to 60. Okay, so this is very hot water. And I will pour one bottle of lactose into the flask. I got a new um, angle camera here so that we can see the details, what's happening throughout the experiment. So yeah, I'm just trying out new stuff. So let's pour the lactose. Okay, that should do. Okay, now I'll add five drops of methylene blue. Bismillah. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Now I will add two small spoonfuls of calcium hydroxide. One and two. Now I will close the rubber, I will close the flask with the rubber stopper and we'll swirl the flask gently to mix the solution. And now I'll put the flask on the tray. So wait, let me move all these out of the way. Wait, what? I missed what happened. So we're not going to disturb the flask for one to six minutes. Uh, we're going to wait and mo monitor the solution's color. Okay, while we're waiting, let me explain what's happening. Why does the solution become colorless? Initially, the solution contains the components for a potential chemical reaction. Lactose itself is more than happy to surrender its electrons. The oxygen dissolved in the water would be delighted to accept these electrons. Interestingly enough, though, oxygen isn't that willing to interact with lactose, and methylene blue can help. This colored compound acts as a carrier in our experiment, taking electrons from lactose and passing them to oxygen. However, at a certain point, the oxygen in the solution runs out, leaving methylene blue in an awkward position. It takes electrons from lactose, but has nowhere to pass them on to. When this happens, methylene blue cannot turn blue anymore and has no choice but to stay colorless. Okay, our six minutes is up, and now when the solution becomes colorless, we can shake the flask. So I'm gonna shake the flask. Wow. It became blue again. And it's becoming colorless again. Wow. That was crazy. That was crazy. Did you see that? Wait. Let's shake it again. And it's blue again. It's going to reach its max blue. And now it's turning colorless. And it's colorless again. Wow. This is pretty cool. And we can repeat this as, like, we can shake it as many times as we want and repeat the steps until all the air inside of the flask go is out but then still you can repeat it again and open the stopper and allow more air in thank you i mean you're welcome i mean thank you anyway it works this was pretty cool and very simple and now for the scientific explanation why does the solution turn blue again we can saturate the solution again with oxygen from the air above the solution when the flask is shaken, oxygen from the air dissolves in the solution. The reaction can then proceed until all the oxygen available in the solution is spent again. However, this trick cannot be repeated endlessly, since the flask is tightly sealed. Sooner or later, all the oxygen from the air will be depleted, and the solution will then remain colorless even when shaken. Nevertheless, the process can be reactivated by opening the flask to let some more air in. That is it for this experiment. 
this was very fun and simple. And yeah, guess it's time to end it. I hope you guys enjoyed. See you in the next experiment. Don't be sure not to miss that one because we're gonna be playing with fire, inshallah. But yeah, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.